Hi everyone, it's Mark from Coach Logic. Um, just getting in touch to let you know that we're not going to be doing as many webinars over the coming weeks. Um, the reason for that is we just want to be able to allow coaches to reflect more. Um, I actually came up in a webinar with uh, Ed Coffin uh, the other day, um, him alongside uh, Stuart Armstrong. Um, and, and are we able to reflect? Have we got the time to reflect? So one of the things I thought about um, sharing with you was a way that you could start to reflect on the great stuff that's already available in all of the Coach Logic uh, community platforms. Um, there's, if you go into any video, uh, like this one here, you can actually clip content. So you can clip things that are important to you. But more than that, you can actually start to create little coaching bubbles, as I'm going to call them. Um, probably appropriate to the time. So if I go into playlists here, um, as you can see, I'm starting to collect stuff anyway. You know, um, these are the kind of things that I'm starting to focus on across the videos. So I'm adding all the school stuff from across different uh, uh, talks. I actually put in some stuff from Mary about how the Dutch hockey clubs are operating, which I thought was cool. And these are all private to me. But then I thought, well, why make it private to just me? Like, why not involve other coaches and create my own little coaching bubbles so um, and this is what I do with players when I create playlists is I get you know three or four players involved and then they add to the attack playlist or whatever it might be so if I go it's private still and I'm just going to call it um, MC coach bubble I wouldn't call it that regularly but I'll just call it um, MC coach bubble create um, and you guys can do this as well right so once you've got that and it's private only you will see it you can then go into settings and um, you can switch it up and you can say right it's private but actually i want to share this with and then you can choose the people so if i was to type in andy um, into this box here um, then i could share and bring andy muir um, muir into my coach bubble so that one there and um, i could also bring kenneth in there um, and my brother ben as well he, he gets an invite uh, ben Cairns, there he is. Okay, so I can invite these guys into my uh, playlist. So, and then I'm going, well, I actually want them to contribute to this playlist so they can edit it as well um, and then add. Okay, so I've got all these people who can now see and contribute to my playlist, uh, confirm. <clears throat> and uh, we can start to add content to that. So you can give a bit of guidance. You can say, listen, I'm looking for stuff on X, or you can say, just let's put all the cool stuff in this and we can discuss it. So once you've set up that playlist, just let the guys know about it. So go at Andy, for example, um, Muir. And again, this is all private. This is between you guys. It's, we, we don't see this stuff um, at Kenneth. Um, and then here. And then finally at Ben. Okay. And then just say, just added you guys to a playlist. Would be great to. Uh, capture the info on here and add the cool stuff. And maybe that just sets up a, a Zoom call between the three of you, four of you, five of you, or however big your bubble is. So, yeah, I guess the challenge is how do we start processing this information? Um, how do we, you know, then make sure that we retain it and then use it in the future? Um, so there's one example. Hopefully I'll think of some other stuff we can do as well over the next few weeks uh, to make sure we're retaining stuff. Right. Thanks very much and uh, have a good weekend, guys. Cheers. Bye.